relationship and Gary Farrell Winery's relationship with the Bacigalupi family is pretty amazing. Um, I love working with them because, first of all, the vineyard has so much history. Uh, I used to work with Helen. Um, Helen and Charles were the couple who originally purchased and planted the Bacigalupi vineyard. They purchased it in 1956 and first planted it in 1964. So it was really an honor for me in particular to be able to get to know her when I first started working with the fruit. My first one or two vintages at Gary Farrell, I called her on the phone and scheduled everything with her and she relayed information to John, her son, who does all the farming. Well now I communicate exclusively with John and Pam, John's wife, and they're just lovely people. They really are willing to bend over backwards and fulfill any requests that we would like. The wines that we produce from the Bacigalupi Vineyard, uh, the fruit in the Pinot Noir, the fruit is velvety, the tannins are silky, the Chardonnay has this unctuous quality. It tends to be very citrus driven, uh, a little lighter on the palate than say Durrell or Rochiele to you know different climates, but just really quintessential Russian River Valley Chardonnay and Pinot Noir from the Bacigalupi Vineyard. I run one very small crew and we pick between 300 and 350 tons. We pick small lots, usually five, six, eight, ten tons a night. Today we go to such lengths to avoid the heat. I mean, we pick at night. We usually don't start till 11, maybe 12 at night. And then we'll pick till two, three, four in the morning. The fruit comes in cold. It's going into a cold tank. So the quality differences that I see from back in the 60s and even the 70s is huge. We're making so much better wines today, just, just probably because of that one thing. I love working with Gary Farrell Winery because of the people. The people are great and they make great wine.